What is going on, guys? We have Jamie Robinson here. Appreciate you hopping on the call, man. Uh, just wanted to do a quick interview with you, ask you a few questions. You've been working with us for about you know, 60, 70 days now. Um, and I just wanted to, to kind of ask a little bit about before you started working with us. I know you spoke with Carrie, I believe, and you know, you got enrolled and you became part of the family here and you know, kind of hear how things are now. Uh, but we can start off, man. Like, what were you doing kind of before working with us? Um, before working with y'all, I basically was just cleaning, uh, two contracts that I have now from my wife doing cold calling, uh, basically really wasn't focused on the business as well. Like finding more contracts. I was just going alone yeah. as like my wife, she would cold call. And once she stopped, then marketing was done. Mm. So wasn't well, really building up as we should have. Okay. So I'm, I'm basically with just cleaning with, with the contracts. I was good with the contract that I had at the point, at, at that point. But I, I got to a point where I wanted to scale it up and make it big as possible. So that's where I was. Cool. Before awesome. working with her. Perfect, man. And what, what, when you said you wanted to kind of scale it up as much as possible, like what were, your, what were some goals that you had for the company in like the next three to five years? Just want to be as big as possible. Uh, work on top of the business and not working in it, not cleaning, having systems in place, uh, people in place to do everything that I need them to do for the business. So, gotcha. Um, and you know, now working with us for the last 60, 70 days, what, what first, what got you to like want to even work with us? Like, I mean, you spoke with Carrie. Like, did you know about us before that? Or like when you spoke with her, it was the first time you kind of knew about us and like, what got you to be like, cool, let me, let me work with these guys. So I, I know, I know about, I know about y'all for about two or three weeks before I actually took the time to, you know, schedule a call with Carrie. Yeah. And, and I remember talking to somebody about y'all and I was like, I, I feel like this is it right here. I feel like this, <laughs> this will help me do the business. It's just something about y'all that made y'all different. And there's not really too many people in the industry doing what y'all doing. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to take a chance, you know? And it, it was like the end of December. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I just want to start the new year off, right? And get the momentum going with the business. And, you know, so I hop on a call with Carrie. Carrie would even got, how should I say it, like, told me about her background, her story and stuff. And I just connected with her. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I waited like a day. I like, I want to do it. You know what I mean? Hop on board. And it's been, it's been great. That's awesome, man. So yeah, let's hop into kind of like the last 60, 70 days. Just kind of hearing your input, some of the success you've seen. Um, was this a decision that you feel like, you know, you, you made correctly and would you recommend kind of us to a lot of the people in the industry as well? <clears throat> Yeah, most definitely. Uh, the only way that I feel like somebody can cannot succeed with y'all if they don't put in the work because the leads just come in. You know what I mean? The leads come in, and I would just leads. I'm doing a connection with people. They want to go out for coffee. They want to meet up and just talk. They, I'm getting invited to groups. Uh, it, it's, it's been it's been amazing, uh, man. Man, I closed on five contracts so far with y'all guys. That's awesome. You know, I'm on, I'm on cleaning, like construction people. Like I just be getting bids to my email to bid on post construction. It, it's been crazy. It's been crazy. Like, I'm getting, I'm getting traffic to my website. <laughs> you know, you know, it's been yeah. amazing. It's been amazing. Man, I appreciate, you know, and you closed five contracts and we're working for what, under like 90 days with you as well. So um, and what you said there was perfect with, in regards of like the only way you can't succeed is if you just don't do the work, like going right. out there, building a relationship, nurturing it, closing contracts. Right. Um, and you've done everything in regards of doing your side. So we had to do our side to make sure everything come together. And that's why everything works so well. Um, if you can, you know, give a few words to people that were in your shoes, which is, you know, starting out the business, not sure, you know, kind of like what direction to go, you kind of want to grow it. What, 
would you give them in regards of advice to and, and why you, they should work with us? Like, what did we have that you felt for, you know, building your business was like the perfect fit uh, besides it being like, you know, uh, the end of the year, wanting to get into the new year, feeling good. And, uh, the one advice I could just tell people is to be consistent. And another thing is I really just can't tell them, uh, they just got a door. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's amazing. Like, they just got to join the business. And I, I just get leads in all the time. You know what I mean? <laughs> I really, I, I, can, I can show the results and stuff like that. Like I said before, I got a walkthrough on Wednesday for seven libraries. They got 11 buildings. Wow. Um, but seven of them won't need cleaning. So I'll meet with them. I meet with two people that day and two other people. Well, one person were for two other buildings on Wednesday. So I could I still work. So my time is very limited. So I'm just trying to build. I mean, I schedule everything on the same day mm -hmm. of the week. And I might have another world go through on a, on a, on a, on a Wednesday. So, dude, just but, relationships, leads, just one person referring you to another. Um, yeah. Dude, that's, that's freaking amazing. And ideally, in, and what advice would you give personally that helped you? Like, what do you do every day to show up to actually make what we help you with successful? Because we can provide these, uh, you know, help people out. But like, what do you think you had and are doing right now that's actually making this stuff work? Like the lead uh, relationships. Just, just following up with people. Um, if like, you know, when you're doing marketing at a high volume, you know, a lot of people is not going to be interested in what you offering. Yeah. So what, what I feel like I, what a lot of people do, if they're not interested, they won't respond back to them and stuff. I'm like, thank you for the time. Thank you for responding. And obviously, I communicate back with the people that's interested in it. You know what I mean? So even, even though they, they, they're not interested right now, yeah, I still try to, you know, show them. Like, I, 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 I try to not to make it like I want something from them. Like, even if I'm not getting nothing from them, I still try to build a relationship with them. So that's basically what I do. Like every, everything that come through, I don't let nothing slide. Dude, that's awesome. So, so yep. it's like <clears throat> every type of opportunity, either it's like yeah, when working with us, obviously we send you people that are actually positive wanting to work with you, but then there's also people that you've, you know, gotten people that you've spoken with that aren't interested, but you want to be able to understand that it's a relationship game. And so because of that eventually they'll want to work with you. So why not build the relationship? Right. You keep it open. I mean, I tell people all the time, every time everybody comes in and like, Honestly, your business can't fail if you just build relationships with everybody. And if when they need your work, they'll come to you and you build a hundred of that, 200 of that. And you have two, 300 people out there that can potentially call you anytime. Right. Um, cool. And since you've joined five closed contracts, you know, ultimately, would you say like the, the investment you've made was like an investment that 10 out of 10, like you would prefer it to everybody to make? Yeah, the investment I made, I'm, I'm very happy with it because even when I'm not done, I mean, when, even when I'm done with y'all, like working with y'all, mm -hmm. well, I really don't want to. But even when I'm done, I feel like down the line, the work that y'all done for me already is going to uh, still be working for me in the future. You know what I mean? Sure. It's like you're just playing A's or C's around, you know, playing C's around and stuff like that. Yeah, it, my business is doing great right now. Yeah, you know what they say, man, how's All business? Right. <laughs> doing great right now. Yeah, the business is doing great. You know, like I said, I'm working and I'm doing other stuff as well. So I'll, I'll be super busy when I get off of work. But, the awesome. business, but I appreciate y'all. Appreciate yeah, I appreciate you too, man. We'll, we'll chat off of this video in regards to like long-term stuff. You know, we want to continue working with you. I mean, oh, yeah. where you're currently at, it's like a perfect spot for us to continue to help you scale up. Um, I mean, it's, it completely honest with you. It's, it's very difficult to find people that can, you know, do what you're doing right now, you know, take care of the leads, nurturing it, understanding that, you know, business is everywhere. Like, you know, we're here, we have amazing coaches, you know, inside our program, you know, we provide opportunities. You probably spoke with Michael Carey a bunch of times already. Um, and you know, with them, like, how did you feel about speaking with Michael with his experience? And then on top of that, Carrie as well, you know, so far the group coaching calls, like how, how have you felt with uh, those as well? Yeah, like for Mike, I was telling Mike before I took one of his ideas. And the idea that I took 
the client, the first clean, the client was so amazed with it. He left a great review and everything like that. And yeah. he was like, two more buildings. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I was like, and I, I told Mike about that and I think thing. And it, it, was, it was one Friday when I was listening and what it was, I never thought about it, but he was like, you know, clean up out front and just go over and beyond and taking the next step made the client super happy. He was like, oh my God, like the cleaner was amazing. I took some pictures, some before pictures and after pictures, sent it to him and stuff. That's awesome. I went over and seen it and he was just amazed. He was so happy and he gave me two more buildings. Dude, that's amazing. Dude, Michael is like a ball of knowledge. He's been in the industry for like 30 plus years. Um, you know, all in all, we want to build like the, the best team here at Scale My Cleaning Business. And something that you mentioned was like nobody else in the game doing what you're doing. And we, we kind of came into the industry knowing that, um, but we started off with just generating leads, which is, you know, something we're extremely good at, but we're adding, you know, a bunch of coaches and mentors that have built businesses themselves and, and freaking Michael's case, 30 plus years, you know, they're, they're people that can help so many small businesses trying to, you know, continue to scale like yourself, uh, grow with the information and do one little piece of information, cleaning in the front, got you more buildings. Like I, I say it all the time. You always got to be selling when you're cleaning, you're selling right? When you're calling them, when you're texting them that picture, you're selling them to work with you continually, right? So right. that's amazing, man. Um, we'll kind of end it off here uh, from from where you're at in, in regards of your business right now, by the end of this year, like what is your goal? Like what are you looking for? What are you looking to achieve by the end of the year? Uh, by the end of the year, uh, I'm looking to be around 30, 35,000 a month in revenue, recurring contracts, uh, have a have a uh, a office, yeah, and you, you know just having everybody else running it, and I'm just looking on top of the business and just focusing on other things. That's what I'm looking at. Gotcha, man. So getting an office, building it to 30, 35 k, and then on top of that, delegating and automating some stuff within the business, so you can right. go ahead and focus on other stuff right now. Perfect, man. So we're, when you started with us, like how much were you doing per month in, in those two contracts that you were working with? Uh, just. Over three thousand. Oh, a little bit over three thousand. Yeah, I've I've been cleaning since last year August. Okay. So, yeah, just over three thousand. Cool. And then in the last like what 60, 70 days, how much in business have you added uh, with those five contracts and some of the ones you have in the the pipeline right now? Yeah, and I also didn't mention I have two proposals out that I got follow up on Monday too as well for post construction cleaning. Mm -hmm. uh, I uh, I bet on that for 28,000, 28,000 for that one. And another one was a, a townhouse community. So they want, they want move in, move outs. Okay. So. So all in all, like, you know, since you started 3K where you were at to like now, where if you were to kind of look at your monthly billing, I'm thinking, you're working with. I'm thinking over 6,000 now. Gotcha. Cool. So you pretty much double your business in regards yeah. to like 60, you know, almost yeah. 70 days so far. And yeah. Yeah. Dude, that's awesome, man. And that's like not even, you know, closing all the deals. There's plenty of people in the pipeline plus relationships are being built with all the things we have, you know, going on LinkedIn, email, you know, sometimes even text messages as well. So um, dude, it's been a pleasure, man. Like, uh, if, if you were to kind of, somebody were, if were to ask like, Hey, like Jamie, they had the opportunity to call you and like, Hey, Jamie, like, Min, you know, Min and Alex, the team over at Scale My Canoe Business, I don't really know if I should do this or not. Like, what, what would you tell them? Man, I would tell them, I would, I would, I would tell them, for first, I would tell them, I, I'll show you the results <laughs> for them. i like, we can hop on, I can show my screen, I'll show you the results, but I'm like, man, they great. Like, y'all not paying me to get up here to, to say any of this. It's just proven, you know what I mean? If anybody, they, they want to reach out to me, and they got questions about it. I'm happy to show them anything, help them out any way that I can. And like, like before they get started, just make sure your LinkedIn profile look good because I have people like, I check out your LinkedIn profile. Yeah. And you look kind of good on there. Like I want to connect, <laughs> let's get some coffee. So yeah. I put my LinkedIn profile up to the best that I can. And if a professional picture up there and it's been working, it's been working. That's awesome, man. We'll kind of simply put it, this stuff works. There's really nothing much you can say, you know, 
uh, results kind of speaks for itself. You know, if anybody want to reach out to you, I appreciate you, you know, being kind and opening to, to speak about sure. working with us and kind of our relationship. And um, on top of that, do we be posting all the celebrations you begin in those seven libraries? It, it's all over. So people can go, go ahead and check those stuff out. But the biggest takeaway I've gotten from this for anybody here who's trying to build their business is you got to put in the work. Jamie did not get here just because a bunch of leads came in and he was just, you know, building his, he put in the work, built the relationship, understood that if you, you know, nurture somebody and understand that you show up every single day and don't let anybody get by you, even if they're uh, not interested, your business will succeed, man. You double your business in what, 60, 70 days. So imagine by the end of this year, I mean, $30,000 is so, so possible. And with the contracts you have in, uh, out there proposal and with leads coming in, dude, no freaking problem. So I appreciate you hopping on here, man. Um, if you guys are watching on YouTube, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, watch all the other YouTube videos we have as well. Uh, and then kind of leave a comment below of your takeaway in regards to the, the call we had here with Jamie here. So, uh, Jamie, appreciate you, man. Yeah. I appreciate you too, man. Shout out to everybody that's involved in helping me out. And I'm, I'm thankful. I'm super thankful. For sure. Appreciate it. Thank you.